Hello, hello. Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video to see if this video resonates with you. If so, please comment, like, and subscribe for your girl. Okay. All right. Yes, you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and hop into this. Okay, cross watchers. Like I said, you guys are welcome. Okay. Now, yes, you guys, I do have a tank top on. I'm a little short so Yes, your girl is comfortable, okay? Yes, comfortable, okay? So, we're going to go ahead and get this started, honey, because this ain't nothing but a message anyway, okay? So, don't worry about what I got on. Worry about the message. All right, all right. Now, this going to be for my Scorpio Summer Rising, okay? Let's see what's going on for my Scorpios. Let's see what's going on. A year from now, okay? Something is going to be happening in a year from now, Scorpio. I'm not sure what that is. But um, it says a year from now for you. Whatever that is. I'm not sure, Scorpio. All right. Spirit, please. Okay. It says yes at the bottom of the deck. Um, Virgo got that as well. Um, reconsider. It says reconsider something, okay? So they're asking for you to reconsider something in your life right now. And it says... Okay, whatever whatever you wanted to happen right now is going to happen within a year. Alrighty. Or if something happened within a year. Okay, maybe you are, um, it took a year for something to happen in your life. I'm not sure. But um, let's see what's going on in your love life. Yes, guys. By the way, I do have some new cards. But I'm not going to expose that until uh, February, Valentine's Day. Around that time once I upload those um, videos. Okay. I'm just getting this out the way, too. It's going to be towards the end of January. Alrighty. Let's just see what energy you guys have for the end of January, okay? That's all I'm doing right now. Let's get some insight, some clarity. I did you guys third because you guys had a lot of views, okay? You guys was, uh, I think, like in third place, okay? Cancer, then Virgo, then you guys. But, yeah. Let's see what's going on for my Scorpios. And... Very soon. So whatever you're wanting is coming very soon. They said decide what you want with your partner. Okay. Children. Okay. Maybe children is affecting your love life right now. All right. Let me get one more. Unrequited love. Okay. So somebody's not feeling the same way as far as someone. And someone is feeling about them, Scorpio. Okay. It says release your ex. Wow. Scorpio. What's going on here? Okay, maybe your ex wants you back, but you don't feel the same way as them. Or this could be your partner dealing with this, okay? But somebody's dealing with somebody that they do not feel the same way about, okay? And children is affecting your love life. And whatever is going to happen is happening very soon. So you need to decide what it is that you want to do going forward with an individual, all right? Some of you could be committed to a Virgo sign. Virgo, excuse me, or Earth sign. Or Capricorn or a Taurus here. Or it could be in your chart. Ah. Let me show that one more. One more time. Sorry, guys. All right. Let's see what's going on with my Scorpio. What's going on with Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising. If you hear that noise in the background, that's my baby girl. Alright. If somebody's not willing to let someone go, alrighty, this could be you or your partner, what have you. Get it where it fits, okay? If somebody's not willing to let somebody know, somebody intuitively know this. Somebody intuitively know this. Somebody has children with somebody that could be dealing with the Sagittarius here. Dang, this card is flying. Maybe a Leo, um, Aries, or a, um, like I said, Sagittarius, Okay. But somebody is not willing to let this particular person go. Somebody's not willing to let this fire sign go. All right, eight of swords here. Okay, somebody's feeling trapped. Okay, page of staff. Damn, this resonates with the Virgo reading. Okay, and somebody is being very childish and immature in this situation. They're not willing to let somebody can have children with this queen of staffs here character, and the person that they have kids with does not want to let them go. That, that, that um, fire sign does not feel the same way. Okay. Judgment. Alrighty, Scorpio. Somebody has already made a judgment about the situation. And they felt like um, they put down the, part, the burdens. This this queen of wands here, staff, has put down the burdens. Okay. Alrighty. They're going towards their stability, their happy home with their children. Alrighty. They're the empress. Wow. You're dealing with an empress. Okay, Scorpio. This could be you. Alrighty. 
a loving individual, someone that has it all, but there could be a snake in the midst. Okay, Queen of Cups here. She's a very loving, caring, beautiful individual here. Look at that snake right there on her arm, right here. You see it? Look at that snake just in the mist. Okay. But look, there, she got it on her hand. She she's holding it like I got control over this. Okay, so it doesn't matter what it is or what's trying to come in between, you know, whatever the situation may be, I have a hold on to this. So, therefore, it cannot go any further than what hold I have on to it, okay? I have a hold on it. I have it underneath control, basically. Yeah, somebody definitely dealing with Leo, okay? This, this woman is very strong, okay? Very strong woman. You could have been dealing with this person from your past, alrighty? Or, um... Like I said, this could be you, Scorpio. Okay, King of Swords. Somebody could have been in there with an air sign. Somebody that was very manipulative. Somebody that was very cold. All right. What is this trying to tell me? Okay, but guess what? Somebody has overcame this person. This is this resonates with Virgo so much. Somebody has um, overcame this individual. They have actually won the battle with this person. They have won the battle with this manipulative, cold individual, okay? This is very manipulative. This person, to the point where I think this person has got their karma. This person tried to block this other individual or probably even hindered y'all love or what, put it where it fits, okay? But somebody definitely is seeking some type of loss in finances because of it, you know? Because of the manipulation and the backstabbing and the wrongdoing, all right? Ooh, jealousy. It's going to be some type of fast communication about this. But this person is going to reach out to you. Okay. Um, this person wants to apologize to you. Some people, this is not for all of you. But this person want to apologize to you about a third party situation. Definitely want to apologize towards you. Okay. They want to turn the wheel. They want things to work in their favor now. They want things to go as smoothly as planned now. Okay. And um, there's going to be some type of fast communication about this. This is coming in fast. Okay. Mm -hmm. Somebody wants a new beginning here. A new passion to beginning at that. They're probably just trying to, you know, pull out their wand. Okay, somebody's moving forward. Somebody could be done with a cancer. But somebody's very looking very beautiful. They, somebody could be single, but somebody looking very beautiful, very abundant, okay? Happiness, yes, higher fun in a marriage. Generosity, give and take, but somebody's blocking it. Somebody's blocking it. Somebody's blocking it. What else for my Virgos? Okay. We have a king of coins here. Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Somebody that's stable. Okay. Somebody could have been trying to be manipulative towards about money. It could have been deceptive towards money. Okay. Yeah. Deceptive with a third party situation. Somebody being deceptive here. Somebody's being deceptive here. This king of coins here. Maybe they're trying to, um, or maybe the situation has came to an end. Let me see. What is the seven of swords here for? What is Seven of Swords here for? Okay, yeah, somebody want to move on to common waters from this third party situation. Okay, about family, about kids. Something definitely has to do with kids here. Okay, so this could be somebody you had kids with. If you don't have kids or your, your lover might have kids and they're dealing with a crazy narcissistic baby daddy, baby mama, but somebody has already turned down this offer and this great sadness from this, okay? Somebody going towards their pinnacles. They're working toward their stability, okay? All right. Somebody's definitely going to come towards someone with an offer, okay? Maybe try to give them the world or somebody trying to offer you something and travel towards you and bring it towards you, okay? Mm. The person is watching you now that you have walked away. Scorpio, or this could, whoever, okay? Somebody's walked away from the situation, so all the other individual can do now is watch and stalk. Okay. For one, reward. Somebody's going to get rewarded, okay, for having to go through what they went through. Okay, one second, you guys. Okay, and y'all, yeah, reward for the loss. Mm-hmm. Somebody's getting rewarded for what they had to go through. Yeah. And the other person is seeking some type of heartache, kindness, happiness. Wow. 
The reward is kindness, purity, happiness, abilities. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. So somebody, so somebody's basically happy. Okay, you're gonna be happy. Alrighty, it's gonna be happiness, abundance. You are protected. You are highly protected, Scorpio, or your person is. Somebody definitely didn't want a Leo. But this person is happy, abundant. She's very kind. She's very loyal. And she just sits on her throne and just minds her business and just worry about her money and her family. And that's all she's concerned about or he's concerned about. But there's always people in the background or naysayers or people trying to bring them down or somebody not willing to let someone go. Okay. Okay, hold on, Mama. Okay, go get mirrors. Okay. And, you know... And basically, that's it. Wow. Let's see what we have. Mmm. So, it comes at the bottom of the deck. My nose itching now. I don't know what that means. So, basically, two of cups here. Um, nine of cups. Wow. The tower. Okay, Scorpio, you're experiencing some type of beautiful love here, but somebody from your past or somebody from your lover's past is jealous. Period. Scorpio. So while you over here in love with an individual, I think another individual is wanting your lover or jealous of the fact that you stole the lover or whatever. I don't know, but somebody. Okay, baby, one second. Because somebody definitely, because I see that you are basically giving your all into someone. You're in love with someone. You're giving your all into someone. And I'm going to just bluntly put it out like this, but the sex is freaking amazing. Okay? I'm going to just say that now. But somebody in the background lurking on you or your partner. Okay, Scorpio? Somebody lurking on you and your partner. Definitely here. So, Ugh. Somebody lurking on you and your partner, boo. Somebody's very jealous. But I wouldn't mind that because I see that your partner is in love with you. You are in love with your partner. And you have a very good woman here or man here. Somebody is very abundant here. Um, is a very good and kind individual. And somebody knows that from the past. And they're jealous. They're mad. You got their wish. Five staffs, conflict, jealousy. What I say? Woo! Somebody's jealousy our relationship. It's a lot of people that doesn't they're 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 jealous of this relationship. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Um, but I do see that you winning. You and your partner is winning. So I won't be too worried about that. Um, I do see that you guys are very highly protected. Okay, your union and everything is highly protected. So I really wouldn't be worried. Like I said, we won't be worried about that. But, but anyway, um, that's all I have for you, Scorpio. Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. Please comment, like, subscribe if this resonated with you. And I'll see you guys in uh, February, okay, for the Valentine uh, videos, okay? Alrighty, guys. See you guys later. Bye-bye. Sorry about that. That's my baby girl. <laughs> Hold on.